Yes! Yes! Why, no. Matt Hardy! Why? Matt Hardy has just won the Andre the Giant Battle there. Royal. It's not done yet. Oh, there, now there. there the it's done. The bell has rung. <laughs> Thanks to Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt has just delete, deleted their feud. <laughs> and he's, he's back. The he's the exact same. He's the exact same. The Lake of Reincarnation. It, it does, does nothing. It does nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Bray Wyatt has just helped Matt Hardy to victory in the Andre the Giant Battle Royal. I picked it. Yeah. I called it. Yeah. I picked that one. Did you guys see Elias in there? He was wrong. Oh. He was wrong. He was wrong. Was it in there? He I picked off. He came close. Elias <laughs> was on the Can you explain real quick why you picked off? Okay. So, the winner of this match usually does nothing. Dolph does, does nothing. nothing. It works. <laughs> Still wrong. Still wrong. Um, John Cena... Sitting in the crowd as a fan is the funniest fucking thing I think I've ever seen. Yeah, so, so, so. <laughs> Just chilling with oh, the crowd. Hugging. Bray Wyatt and Matt Hardy hugging. Holy hell, what happened? I don't get it. Holy hell, what happened? So the Lake of Reincarnation Seen looks transformed him into a face? Yeah, there's Cena sitting in the crowd. It's the Lake of Face turn. <laughs> the Lake of Face turn. We're home from our trip. There's no clowns. We're enjoying WrestleMania. We'll tell you about what happened. It was horrible. Where's Jeff Hardy fit in? Yeah, where the hell's Jeff Hardy? What the fuck's going on here? He's cleared, I don't know. All right, what's next? Women's Battle Royal? Cruiserweights? Cruiserweight next. Cruiserweights. Yeah, cruiser Cena cares. Cena is clapping <laughs> for your new cruiserweight champion, Cedric Alexander, which I don't know how the hell he kicked out of three fucking finishers in a row. I mean, the man got pummeled with like a, a back... Frankensteiner, her I called yeah. it a Frankensteiner. Holy shit! Yeah. <laughs> Hurricanrana, the 0 5 4 the 0 and then he, foot on the ropes. Cedric got the foot on the oh, ropes. Drag him to the center, and then pin them. Video games. Video oh, games. You can learn this from yeah. video yeah. effing games. Video games. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's how you do it on WWE 2K18. Yeah. So in the end, it was the lumbar oh, check, which puts the cruiserweight strap on Cedric Alexander. That match was lit. Cena still clapping. He's still clapping. He's still clapping. He's like I didn't even know these guys were on the roster. <laughs> he goes, wait, who are these guys? They're pretty good, these guys. <laughs> Bunch of male midgets, it's fine. <laughs> Cena sitting in the crowd for WrestleMania is the funniest fucking thing in the history of our sport. So, in the end, the Women's Battle Royal just went down, and Naomi, Naomi pulled it off, but we all thought we were going to be Bailey boy. I, <laughs> I knew it would come down to Sasha Banks and Bailey. It was just a question of which one was going to win. And... In the end, Sasha Banks was like, oh, come on, Bailey, let's be friends. I'm sorry about, you know, doing the whole Lion King thing. And then, nope, Bailey was like, oh, bitch, and hucked Banks right over the top. Bailey thought she won. But no, there was a sneak attack. There was a sneak attack by Naomi. She was waiting the entire time. And then she came in and tossed oh, Bailey after it. a big time. I, I saw Naomi. Laying on the outside of the ring. Yeah, that but... Whole, that, whole match, that whole match, this one here. Who's that? Who's that? No, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? I don't know. I didn't know all those NXT, random NXT, NXT chicks NXT, right? from the, the May Young Memorial, they whatever were, they did. Yeah, Classic. they were all wearing different colors. Yeah, and, new yeah. colors, new outfits. How the hell is I supposed to tell who the hell all these people were? So there was a couple of them I didn't know who they were. We had Bailey come out dressed up like Rocky Maivia. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> remember my, Rocky Maivia? I remember. I remember. <laughs> the blue chipper. But pretty cool to see Naomi win. That was... Uh, Unexpected. Yeah. No, but none of us picked it. I picked Sasha. Becky elimination. Like, what was it? <laughs> and, and in the beginning, no, I thought that was better than the men's battle royal, right? Yeah, much yeah, more, yeah. much more entertaining. And it was funny because Becky Lynch had an entrance, had an entrance, and then all the girls came out. Yeah, thrown out for no reason. But then random. Bailey and Sasha Banks had an entrance. Yeah. Like, what the hell are they doing here? We have a new WWE Intercontinental Champion. Seth Rollins just hit the curb stop down on the Miz and takes the Intercontinental title to become a Grand Slam champion. The first championship. The only championship he's never held. But wait, he wasn't Universal Champ. That's what they said on the TV. I'm just going by what they said on the television. Now. Has he been U.S.? Yeah. Yeah, 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 he won that at SummerSlam oh, with Cena. Said, just, he's right. swinging the belt. Look, he's swinging the belt. Perfect. He's swinging. <laughs> that match was lit. How the hell does Seth Rollins jump 15 feet high off a turnbuckle with a frog splash with a crossbody? And then, you know, Balor did not come out in the demon paint, and people were pissed. But it's hard for you to say people are pissed because he's supporting a good cause, the LBGT, but people were pissed. 
The salt running all over Twitter right now. It wasn't one on one though. Yay! Mark Ballard be the, the rainbow paint demon. goes one on one. The demon. rainbow demon. That'd be good. <laughs> That'd be cool. Where's the, yeah. where's the pumpkin demon? That'd be awesome. We got, if you painted, we got you did Rob. We got Rob. The demon thing, but all, but all rainbow colors. <laughs> That would look lit. I want to see it. I'm officially on board for the Rainbow Demon Balor paint. <laughs> that match was awesome. Has that been the best match of the night thus far? I'd say so. Thus far. Yeah. Thus far. We got Pyro. We got Pyro. Pyro's back. Fire! Works. To open the show, they blew shit up, and I'm one sure. One time a year. <laughs> the one time... That's what they should build WrestleMania. The yeah. one time a year when Pyro comes around. Yeah. <laughs> what? what the fuck has happened? I'm going home. What the I'm fuck? Going Slug, where are you going? Oscar just tapped out to Charlotte Flair. Nope. How? Nope. What? Why? The streak is over. Holy hell. Nope. How the fuck? Nope. Nope. Slug's nope. done. Slug's done. He's losing horrible in the predictions. Our little predictions pool right now. He's gotten everyone wrong so far. Well, we all had Oscar. We all had Oscar. That was the safest bet of the entire pay per view. And she just fucking tapped out. How the hell? Charlotte retains the women's championship? The world is a complete shock! All that build up, that huge streak, and she doesn't even win the title? People are pissed! What in the holy hell? We see Charlotte pull out a Spanish fly off the top rope. What else did she do? She beat her with the figure eight. What else did she The suplex outside. The suplex to the outside of the ring. No, that was Oscar that drilled Charlotte with that. Okay. Oh my god. I don't even know I, I'm shocked. I'm we, we're speechless! We're speechless! <laughs> People are pissed! Oh my god, I can't believe this just happened. I, this is this is a, as big of a moment as when Brock Lesnar beat The Undertaker. Uh, almost, no, no, almost. No. But this is, this is pretty shocking. For the women, this is for just women, as big. Yeah, yeah. Asuka's been undefeated for five years. And she tapped. It's not like she was pinned. No. She tapped out. I can't believe it. All, all that build up just to have her lose to Charlotte. <laughs> Charlotte's the greatest in the history of our sport. Just put over Charlotte. Just she won't be denied. They just built Asuka up to <laughs> just, have just... Charlotte knock her down. All right, so this is the plan, guys. <laughs> We're going to build up Asuka for years just to put over Charlotte. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that Asuka would win. Asuka would be undefeated for a year. Face Ronda Rousey next year for the championship. That's what everybody thought. Two yeah, undefeateds I... versus... That would have been great. That's it. Ronda Rousey's going to lose later on tonight, too. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, wait a minute, something's happening. John Cena has just leapt out of the crowd. The referee's had Undertaker's here. The Undertaker's the here. Told Cena, Undertaker's here. John Cena's running to the back right now. He's going to get his gear. Okay, he's going to find the gear. Undertaker. Get my gear. Wait, he's already wait, wearing wait, wait, wait. sneakers. Which shirt? Which shirt? Green? Purple? Orange? Uh, blue? I don't know. Which shirt is he going to wear? What color of the Fruity Pebbles will he's, Super Cena represent he's tonight? He's closet, guys. When he takes on the Undertaker, he's the only fan allowed to jump the barricade and run <laughs> backstage. Imagine I tried that shit. It'd be... It'd well, be you jail. Chip, you chip You'd never make it face. over the barrier. <laughs> Fuck you guys. <laughs> well, you it's right. title change city tonight. I came back for Rusev. What happened? He lost. <laughs> <laughs> Tax slug returns. The United States Championship was on the line. And Jingle My Balls has just won the United States Championship. He they called it. put in Rusev to get pinned. That was the only reason. <laughs> they pinned Rusev Day on Rusev Day. The, this year's WrestleMania takes place on Rusev Day, and what happens? Rusev eats the pinfall in the Our fucking pin match. Rusev that whole crowd, they on panned Rusev out. Everyone's going for it. Everyone's right? For it. The fucking, the entire place. It's like having Daniel Bryan lose at WrestleMania 30. Remember? <laughs> this year, Bullshit. Yeah. No, you put Daniel Bryan over too stupid. We'll see. They're going to miss the boat on Rusev. They are. They're fucking dumb, man. I don't know, good match overall. Randy Orton hitting some RKOs. Aiden English getting involved. And the other asshole with uh, Jingle My Balls, what's his name? One of the Sing Bros. A Sing Bro. And then, oh, RKOs. RKOs for everybody, but it was the Colossus at the end, yeah. which gives Jingle My Balls his Snake. first ever. He was the only guy in the match who's never had yeah. the United States it title. Like a quick match. It did. It seemed it short, rushed. especially for a rushed. fatal four-way. It seemed rushed. Yeah. Well, they're probably... Yeah, we got four more hours. That's we got to run more commercials, <laughs> damn it. We got more commercials to play, god damn it. Is Triple H going to tap to Rousey? No, here comes... Uh -oh. oh, Steph came in. Oh, I thought he was going to tap. Dude, this match has been lit so far. This has been great. Yeah, been. They're doing a nice job. Wow. Everybody's doing what they got to do here. I'm impressed.
I'm impressed. They I thought this was going to be a train wreck. So <laughs> Kurt Angle has got Triple H in the ankle lock. Ronda's got Stephanie in the arm bar. It's going to be a double tap. Who's going to tap first? <laughs> They're both reaching for each other. <laughs> tap together. <laughs> tap together. <laughs> oh. oh. Oh, did not see that coming. I thought that was going to be the end. That was a perfect finish right there. Triple H just pulled his leg and made Kurt Angle clothesline Ronda off of Stephanie. What a spot. <laughs> it almost looked like a heel turn for a second, didn't yeah. it? Let go, Steph. You got to lose now. This match has been good and it needs to be over. <laughs> Immediate tap. Immediate right tap. Now. Ronda Rousey just made Stephanie McMahon oh, tap out. Oh, the crowd's going wild. Oh, Dana White in the crowd. <laughs> An epic performance. One of the greatest tag team matches ever. <laughs> Kurt Angle, old drunk Uncle Angle. <laughs> Awkward and slow. Awkward and slow. Pulled it out. In the end, he's got. How did he get busted? I don't know. Maybe there was blood in Angle's eyes. We don't know how the hell it happened. <laughs> but what a match! What a match! That delivered ten times. My expectations were way down for this. We thought it was going to be a steamy pile of poo, but they really lit it up for that match. WrestleMania. That's how it's done right there. All right. So the new day's coming out right now for the match with little. Pancake people! Why the fuck? And there's a tax slug called these pancake graphics on either side of the entrance. They're bad. They're, you call them big They're turd piles. Turd piles, yes. <laughs> and they have little pancake people. They're little... Why do they where's, have to have tights on under where's the Hornswoggle? pancake? I don't know. Where's Hornswoggle? I have no idea. You know, and I was worried about the Triple H entrance, him being on the bike. Is that going to ruin the American Badass entrance for Undertaker? It'll be like three hours from now. Yeah, don't forget. Don't forget. But there's pancake people, for fuck's sake. <laughs> so look who joins us, ladies and gentlemen. He's finally here. Just, He's... Uh, <laughs> just like Taker. Just how here when he feels like it. Uh. <laughs> so imagine planning your WrestleMania entrance, right? And you're like, I have this idea. Pancake people, except they're going to be dwarfs. They're going to be little pancake people, and we're going to call them the short stacks. That sounds great. What? Yeah. Nothing? No? You want to do? Do it. We just had the New Day versus the Usos versus the Bludgeon Brothers for the, for the WWE Tag Team Championships of SmackDown, and the oh. Bludgeon Brothers just owned that. They killed two, the two most dominant teams for the last year and a half. It was a short match. Just yeah, short practically match. squashed. Squash. Did they get any yeah. offense at all? Yeah, but boom, cool. the Bludgeon Brothers took the titles, and I was the only one out of all his assholes that picked that right. Yep. I'm like, why? How would you not pick them? They're awful. The other two teams have had those belts for the last year and a half. It's time for somebody new. <laughs> That was so, almost pointless at this point. That was a squash match. That was a literal squash match. John Cena just got squashed by The Undertaker. It all started. John Cena comes to the ring. The referee's like, no, no, no. No, no, no. John Cena's like, what? And then the lights go down. It's worse shit. I'm leaving. And we... You're taking my gimmick. He already left earlier. Then he came back. So the lights go down. But then Elias came out and I popped hard. Right. Yeah, that was great. <laughs> that was fantastic because people were, mad. People were mad. pissed. People were fucking pissed. We won The Undertaker. Elias comes out, runs down the crowd. Yeah. Cena gets uh, in there, up. beats we're him up, up a little bit. I'm not doing a reaction here or nothing. Shut up. He's going for ice cream. Go ahead. He, he won. <laughs> no, no, no. I'll wait for you guys. Asshole. I'm trying to do a reaction that here. That was some bullshit. People bullshit. are pissed. Bullshit. What'd you expect? So Cena beats Something. up. That so, was a cycle. That was something. I'm going to stab him. All right, super dick. <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of like the first thing we did see It was like this far away. Right, let's get back to this. So Elias gets his ass beat by John Cena. John Cena throws up the don't even care. I'm leaving, whatever. Finally, lights go out. Electric bolts in the ring. Cena's hat and coat are there. Taker's hat. Taker's hat and coat are in the ring. He's got me all fucked up. <laughs> a lightning strike, boom, and then they're gone. And then the Undertaker comes out. No American badass. And people were pissed. We wanted Biker Taker. And he comes out, literally squashes Super Cena. Did we really want Biker Taker? I wanted Biker Taker. Yeah. Because it brings I, the whole thing full circle. Full circle, exactly. Biker Taker is the one that met She's John Cena. On that first night on SmackDown. Yes. Ruthless aggression, exactly. Whoa. Smart facts. Not to give a shit about Roman Reigns, but it completely invalidates Roman Reigns' win over. Made last year party because that's what I like. 
<laughs> it made last year's retirement of Taker pointless to just have Taker come out and squash John Cena. That wasn't a dream match. He left. He, to be fair, he didn't know you did that earlier. Well, it's true. <laughs> Stop being late, Al. <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know what to think of that. That was just... That was a squash match. That was a literal squash match. It was actually a steamy turn, to Cena be honest. No offense. <laughs> right. It was, it was like, how do we take get Taker on the card without actually doing anything? Yeah. But just to squash Cena? I mean, fucking Cena? You could anybody else in that match. There was, but there was no reason for him to fight anybody else. Oh, You're fighting really Primo. Here you go, squash <laughs> You guys were expecting a big long match with Taker and Cena? Something. Something, exactly. That was something. Why do it? That was something. No, no, Why? no. Why do it? We could have had. We wanted to see Taker. We could have had like a Rock and Hogan type deal. Yeah. Yeah. You know? I, I thought it would have been that, that same That kind of level. Match. That yeah. level, right. There was some excitement behind the match. Because you don't need Stare to down. the psychology there. Right. Yeah. There was no psychology there. It was a couple moves and it was over. Horse shit. The first fail of Mania, the rest of the show's been lit. This I, I sucked. Think, I think they kind of took what they could get from Taker. <laughs> yeah, I'm all Do some right. psychology! What was, was shorter, this match or Goldberg Brock last year? Goldberg and Brock was great last year, though. No, it which was, was shorter? Which was a shorter uh, match? I don't know. Uh, who, who knows? Who cares? People are pissed. Okay, so yeah. we just witnessed the in ring return of Daniel Bryan. Right. And they just beat Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn. Right. And now their asses are fired. Yeah. From SmackDown. From SmackDown. From SmackDown. From SmackDown. From SmackDown. That means they're going to Raw. <clears throat> Duh. <laughs> <laughs> A dur. Oh, oh look. Bree. Oh, oh, Daniel. Oh, Dude, he's, he's making out with Bree. Bree. He's totally making out yeah, on the ringside. He's going to walk away. Gonna have <laughs> he is. He's going to have a giant thing. Give me, oh, give me a kiss, down. Bree. Don't scroll down. Don't scroll down. <laughs> I want to stick my tongue in your mouth, Bree. Wow. <laughs> so, Daniel Bryan and Shane McMahon win the match. Yep. And uh, that was kind of a not very eventful match. People yeah. weren't really into it. Uh, time is it, waning. It picked up when Daniel Bryan got it. Well, of course, good. naturally, because yeah. he brings the excitement. But. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but fire. it's already been five hours. It, we're five hours into the show. You're about yeah. 20 minutes into the predictions video. Yeah. And yeah, WrestleMania is running wild right now, but yeah, we're, we're ready for some title match action. Yeah. We want to find yeah. out who the hell Braun's tag yeah, partner that. is. Oh. She did it! Nice. She did it, Nia Jax! It's the brand new Raw Women's Champion! She just dropped Alexa Bliss off the second rope with a Samoan... What do you call that? Drop? drop. The Samoan drop! Yeah, duh! You <laughs> said the word already. I, I, yes, I dropped. That's why I confused myself. So we have a new... We have a new Women's Champion! I can't believe the match that they just put on! I can't believe that Nia Jax pulled it off in the end! And all these idiots! They all doubted it! Who'd you pick, yeah. Alexa? Alexa? Alexa, Alexa, uh, Alexa. We assumed that Oscar was gonna we, win. Yeah. Why would we you assume? I assumed that both titles were gonna change a thur, and that's what happened. Well, no. No, that's not what happened. <laughs> <laughs> well, Nia won the belt, and that's what happened, and that's what matters, motherfucker. And there's there's the Rock's mom right there, hugging Nia Jax, celebratory hug. That's how you get a title. Yeah, yes. That's how you get a title. Be related the Rock. You Are you trying to say this was nepotism? Yes. Is that yes. what you're trying yes. to say? Blue Nia Jax is amazing and she won the belt and I will hear nothing else. Not Bitch. I'm yeah. sure it happened. Bitch. Bring on Braun Strowman's tag partner. The dream match lived up to its moniker. AJ Styles versus Nakamura. Dream match. It put... The Ninja oh, Twins to sleep. It just didn't really Everything have a sense of sleep. urgency to it. Nothing. It was very slow, very methodic. Everybody's like, uh, everybody on Twitter, Grim, up. stop saying it's boring. It's going to pick up. It's going to pick up. It didn't pick up. It just ended. Matches. They both had individually and together had better matches. Just AJ Styles has had amazing matches with so many other people. It's just, as I said... The Royal Rumble and everything. I said, Nakamura does not belong in this match. I don't care how good their match was at New Japan years ago. Nakamura is not bringing it in the WWE like he did in NXT or NJPW. It just, Nakamura just phoned it in. He, he was terrible. Nakamura was boring at, what was it, Fat Lame? Fat Lame? Yeah. Uh, Rusev. I remember they just phoned it in. It was rest holds, rest holds, Gonzaga. And then on SmackDown they had a, a, a better match. Yeah. Which was funny. Which is funny, exactly. And then here, uh, the, the the only good spot in that whole match was the finish. Shin, Shinsuke Nakamura yeah, went for the Kinsasha, yeah. countered it into the awkward forward face splash. What's it called? Styles Clash. The Styles Clash, and it's over. AJ Styles retains the dream match. 
People are pissed. I'm pissed. It was boring. I'm still pissed. I, I don't know if it's just because it's we're five hours in or if the crowd the, is burned out. They were not having it at all. No, but like, I've been here since four o'clock. I, I have a feeling the crowd's gonna pop when Lesnar and Reigns go at it, though. I don't know. I hope so. Uh, now they're hugging Lesnar. I'm oh. Lesnar. Nakamura and AJ Styles are now hugging in the ring because they are best friends. They are best friends. <laughs> and uh, we still got two more matches. We did. And we it's, got a Mania Payday. It's quarter after 11. Yeah. Heel turn here. Come on, heel turn. Heel turn. Heel turn, heel Nakamura. Turn. Punch him out. Do something exciting, please. I love Nakamura. I do. His entrance was epic. The entrance of this match was amazing. It was. It was pretty good. The match was a snooze fest. And there it is. Nakamura. Nakamura went to go present Nakamura the WWE Championship to AJ Styles. He got down on his knees like he was going to marry him. Like he was going to propose to him. And then nailed him in nutsack. He mashed his taters. Shit's tater tots. <laughs> well, you know what? Maybe this will make Nakamura a little more exciting if he's heel. And we'll get a good, a good match at Backlash. <laughs> Maybe they'll deliver a better match at Fatlash. Now he's uh, kicking him in the face. He'll turn Nakamura. This is the most See, now the crowd's on their feet. Now the crowd's into it. Because something interesting's happening other than rest holds. Oh, my God. Stop. Somebody stop the damn man. <laughs> what the fuck are the referees to pull him off? The bell's rung, motherfuckers. Okay. I, I'm in stunned disbelief right now. I'm... Braun Strowman has just won... The Raw Tag Team Championships with a, a, an eight-year-old kid, Nicholas, that he found in the he, crowd. He's got to be at least 12. Does that kid get to hold the tag title? He's, he's a tag, tag team tag champion. champion. All this build-up for who's going to be Braun's tag partner. He comes out and says, my tag partner could be you, you, you. He walks out into the crowd and legitimately, well, obviously it's fake. I mean, the kid's a plant. Probably somebody's kid. Uh, whose kid is that? Who do we think? Bray Wyatt's kid? Maybe that's Bray Wyatt's kid. It's... Clearly, one of the wrestlers' kids, some sort of actor kid of some type. Well, he's like 23, I don't think. Yeah. No, Braun's like 34. But Braun Strowman walks out into the crowd and pulls up this kid that looks 10 years old, has long hair. Some people even thought it was a girl, but it's a boy. His name's Nicholas. You could have at least got Goldberg's kid, you know? He has experience. Right. I mean, fuck, James Ellsworth could have stood there and done nothing. Kurt Hawkins could have stood there and done nothing. I but now you legitimately have an eight-year-old kid as, as one half of the tag team champions because Braun didn't want to pick a partner. He picked a kid out of the crowd who didn't do shit. I don't understand at all. People um, are pissed. Usually you have a good wrestling mystery as a good, some kind of a payoff. This is the worst possible payoff. Worst possible payoff, exactly. We were all, we were expecting the big show. Big Cass, James Ellsworth, uh, Bobby Lashley, Rey Mysterio. What were the other names? Oh, wrestler. A wrestler. <laughs> Anybody would have been better than this, Joe to be honest. Junior. I mean, it's kind of cool and heartwarming. Well, what do you want on Raw tomorrow? But yeah, you, what want, the... you want Braun to be heartwarming? No! Right. I want Braun to kill people, which what he did. He won the tag titles all by himself. What did that little kid do to deserve a tag team championship? Nothing for nobody. They could have pulled a Santino and had a new debut. Yeah. Something, yeah. yeah. Braun Strowman walked right past No Way Jose. <laughs> He's like, no, no, and I'm pretty I'm sure I saw Pat Buck, too. What the fuck? What the fuck, Shane? Oh, that was weird. Didn't I leave before? You <laughs> what the fuck just oh, happened? Shit. Brock Lesnar just beat Roman Reigns. Did he seriously win? I'm never watching wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> if, I had, if I had another shirt on under than this, I would rip this off. <laughs> Brock, yeah. You all thought? This we is the worst thought. fucking crap ever. <laughs> Six? Was it six or seven? I think that might have been... No, that... He kicked out a five F5s. Roman Reigns kicked out a five F5s. I think that was a six. And then... And then Brock Lesnar bloodied him up. And then we seen the big Roman comeback with spear, spear. Brock kicks out. He stood up for another spear. Brock caught him. F5. For the sixth one. One, two, three. Brock Lesnar retained. Horse shit. <laughs> you know what it means? Dana White fucking worked us. <laughs> the whole fucking... Uh, <laughs> hour is a bullshit. Roman Reigns was a bloody mess. He was bleeding everywhere. I can't... It's fucking midnight. <laughs> it's fucking 12.03. <laughs> Roman Reigns lost. He's got a red mask. <laughs> Roman I can't, lost. I can't... I can't right now. <laughs> 
WrestleMania. I don't know. You guys seen my thoughts for the whole show. The beginning of it, I loved everything. Towards the end, a little bit of crap. It sucks. <laughs> but this was amazing. Why? And I like Roman. Fuck you, get my subscribe. I do like Roman, and wait. I was full well accepted I'll, I'll he was going to win. Not like they hate him. I like him. I was full well I like willing to accept that he was going to win and be the Universal Champ, and I was pumped that Rock was leaving. I was willing to I accept that, to too. I, I was ready for that. <laughs> champ at least on your damn show yeah. <laughs> guys yeah. thanks for watching Bullshit. i hope you enjoyed my reactions and uh it's please like this video leave a comment subscribe for more and i'll tell you about what happened with the clowns tomorrow and if you're not down with that we got three words for you eat it yeah go to bed